guys, how's it going? And welcome to this Fulham vs Burton Albion match preview. So the Brewers come into the game on what is actually a really disappointing result uh, at home to Queen's Park Rangers. Uh, a really poor run of home form continued as uh, the R's came out 3-1 winners there. And it was especially uh, disappointing to concede those three goals. Uh, poor defending from all three of them if I'm honest. And uh, could have easily uh, been even 1-1. Uh, if we'd marked our men. Uh, obviously the only goal in that game uh, coming for the Brewers was, as per usual, Lloyd Dyer popping up with I believe his sixth goal of the season, uh, or it might have been his fifth, uh, but he dribbled around Alex Mithies, tapped into the open net. Uh, Fulham aren't doing that bad themselves so far this season. Uh, they currently sit just outside the playoff places uh, on 42 points. And uh, the Brewers' last home win was in fact against Fulham. Uh, so they've got a chance now to get back out and get a bit of revenge. Uh, so for the Fulham team news, uh, they're going to uh, check up on Tom Kearney, who is their skipper, uh, ahead of our visit to Craven Cottage tomorrow. He set out of last weekend's uh, win at Middlesbrough due to a recurrence of a knee injury. Uh, Florida Ite is set to miss out again with a hamstring problem. Thomas Callas and Rui Fonti are pushing for recalls after dropping to the bench against Middlesbrough. So the Brewers were dealt uh, an injury blow this week with the news that Will Miller will be missing out the remainder of the season with a knee injury. Uh, he, suff uh, he suffered a detached kneecap in the defeat to QPR last weekend. Uh, but unlike long-term absentee Liam Boyce, he did not actually sustain any ligament damage. Uh, so it does sound pretty painful. So all the best on a speedy recovery, Will. Uh, now, Liam Boyce, uh, there's a name for you. If you haven't uh, forgotten who he is, of course, our record signing. Uh, he's he's uh, about to start training with us uh, ahead of his recovery for the knee injury. Uh, there's still a uh, still a chance that he might be able to make the uh, his debut before us uh, before the end of the season. Uh, versatile attacker Martin Samuelson obviously arrived on loan on Wednesday it was. And uh, it's almost certain that he'll go straight into the starting eleven in place of Will Miller. Uh, so this is only the second meeting between the two sides at Craven Cottage. Uh, the last match finished 1-1 as uh, Jackson Irvine's goal was cancelled out by a very late equaliser for Fulham. Uh, so Burton, uh, sorry, Fulham have picked up 13 points from possible 15 in their last five league games, winning four of them and drawing one. Uh, more than the Cottages have picked up in their previous 11 games, which was uh, 12 points, winning 3, drawing five, and, uh, drawing 3 and losing 5. Now, after winning just one of our opening 10 away games this season, uh, the Brewers are now on one of three consecutive victories on the road. Them obviously coming against Bolton, uh, Reading and Sheffield Wednesday. All teams that are towards the uh, bottom half of the table. Uh, so it's going to be very interesting how we line up against the side, obviously pushing for promotion this season. Uh, Abubakar Kamara has bagged a brace in two of his last three league appearances for Fulham. He only scored two goals uh, in his 19 such appearances beforehand. Uh, so if anyone's going to get on the score sheet, if Kamara starts, he could well be uh, the one celebrating Fulham's goals, or if they do get any in that game. Uh, now, uh, I think it's going to be a very, this is a very tough game to predict in my opinion. Because uh, if we play how we played against, um, how we played against uh, Sheffield Wednesday, Reading and even Bolton uh, on the road uh, with that 5-4-1 formation, hitting them on the counter-attack and getting some nice quick goals at the pace of Lloyd Dyer, Martin Samuelson and uh, with Luke Sakins up front. Uh, but I do think that Fulham are really going to come at us and we're, our defence is going to have to hold very, very firm. It's going to be a really tough match. Uh, and I'm actually going to uh, go with a 1-1 uh, score prediction. I reckon that Martin Samuelson will get a debut goal for the Brewers. Uh, I reckon it will be the second goal of the game, though. I think Fulham will score uh, relatively early on, first 20 minutes or so. And uh, Martin Samuelson will bag one in the second half. And we'll travel home with a point, similar to we did uh, last in September last season. So yeah, you can let me know your score predictions down in the comments below. I will actually be travelling into London 
uh, to Craven Cottage and I will of course be uh, taking you with me uh, as we look to continue this very good run of Away Form. So thank you very much for watching this video and I'll see you all next time.